Thanks, JC. A group of Fra in Franklin County began its Memorial Day by holding ceremonies for fallen veterans at small cemeteries. News 3's Danny Valle caught up with the group that wants this tradition to continue for generations to come. Again, our nation has assembled to honor its heroic dead. Help us to remember with reverence the valor and devotion of our departed comrades. Ten cemeteries, three hours, one purpose to honor the fallen and those still standing. They deserve it. Acknowledgement that they was fought for our country and they served our country and they deserve to be recognized every year. The Christopher American Legion held its annual Memorial Day ceremonies across Franklin County's smaller cemeteries, including Hickory Corner Cemetery. It's the final resting place of two veterans, one from the Civil War, the other from the War of 1812. The Legion's post commander, Roger Rice, says the group began fixing the cemetery last October. And now we cleaned it all off. This spring we went back to work and dedicated, put a flagpole up, and we put a flowers on every tombstone up there this year. First time in at least 10 years. Each ceremony starting with a reading, followed by a 21 gun salute. Ready, fire! and ending Ready, with a familiar rest. haunting tune. Bugler, sound taps. You never want to forget your, your veterans. And you know, they, if it wasn't for us, we wouldn't have the freedom we got. Never forget, two small words, one sole message for thousands of souls remembered this Memorial Day. Remember the ones that passed on, died in the war, even died afterward, you know, it's a time to recognize our country. Reporting in Christopher, Danny Valle, News 3. Rice credits efforts put forth by the community, including donations and volunteer work from residents, to properly restore Hickory Corner Cemetery to give those there the honor they deserve. And with the